Hey guys, I'm at Justin's house. We're looking at doing a full system replacement. We'll pull this furnace out, new coil on top of the new furnace, rebuild up into the existing supply ductwork with a new plenum. Return drop should be able to stay where it's at. If anything, we'll put a little bit of a transition to the right in a new return drop, but I think this one will be okay. We'll do a new one inch media cabinet in between the return drop and the furnace, and then we're gonna have to take up a little bit of space here on the left side of the furnace um, so we can fit our be with furnace in. Drain lines go down to the floor here in front of the unit, so we'll just reconnect all of that or put new vinyl in. And then the refrigerant lines here will get flushed and pressure tested. They run up above the ceiling to the outside. Um, the flue pipe is currently ran in B vent, so it's the 4M metal fab, and that runs up to a B vent T here. So we'll just um, all that B vent looks like it's in really good shape, so we can reuse the B vent back down into the new system. Um, water heater flue pipe is all up to code. There is a humidifier and a UV light back here on the back of the system. Um, both of those are going to end up coming out, and uh, we may end up putting a new air scrubber in. So that should be everything downstairs in the basement. All right, guys, here's our outdoor unit. We'll set our new outdoor unit back down in the same spot. Some of these uh, brick stones are probably going to have to move forward a little bit. Let's bring a bag of rock. Like two. Uh, new disconnect box and we'll actually go ahead and reinstall all the lines up.